you do a lot of analysis in Excel, but you want to create reports in Word or PowerPoint, you can use your charts and tables from Excel and link them so that they automatically update as the data from your spreadsheet changes. So we're going to look at a few examples of that and how to do it. So you have a spreadsheet. Here's mine's called Apple Charts. And I have just a little basic analysis on Apple. And I'm going to take my Apple Cash chart. I'm going to copy it, Control C. I'm going to go into my Apple report, go to Paste Special. And I want to click Microsoft Excel Chart Object. And it's very important that I click Paste Link. It will link the data and make sure that any changes you make in your Excel document are reflected in your Word document. Click OK. Your chart shows up right there. And then if I go back and make a change, let's say I change the Apple Cash to zero, you can see my chart changes here. In Word, my chart changes. Perfect. It's exactly what you want it to do. I could do the same thing with this table over here. Control C, go to my Word document. And I'm going to paste special. This is a Microsoft Excel worksheet object. Click paste link. OK. And my table is going to show up right there. If I go back here and I change my iPhone's unit sales to 300 million from 150 million, if I go to my Word document, that same change is reflected right there. Now in PowerPoint, it works exactly the same way. Click on the chart that you want to include in your PowerPoint, Control Copy. Then paste special into the slide. It's a Microsoft Excel chart object. Paste link. OK. You can size it so that it fits your report. Great. Then I'm going to go back and I'm going to double the analyst estimates for 2015 revenue. You'll see the spike here in my chart. And in my PowerPoint chart, you'll see the exact same spike. And again, for the table, we're just going to control copy, go to the PowerPoint, next slide, paste special, Microsoft Excel worksheet object, paste link, OK. And I'm sure you're going to have words in your reports, unlike my sample report. And I'm going to change the coloring here for my table to yellow. So all the changes that I had made in my Excel spreadsheet are reflected in my two reports. Don't forget to subscribe for more Excel tips and tricks.